but she's kind of mad about it. Kind of mad at me, actually. Oh, yeah. What are you doing, Ezra? I am the freakiest person on earth. We're gonna be spending 30 days completely downsizing our house. I don't know why no one can beat me. I, do, I just do this. No, no, look at me. The problem, the reason why we can't beat her is because you can't not laugh when you look at her face. Her face is just so funny. Here comes our fire lady. Oh, I think she's actually... I think she's actually... Oh, I think you were scaring her because we're being so loud. Let me see you go on fluffy. Ready? Be fluffy, 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 fluffy. This, we're trying to do some school. Look at this little cozy girl. She's like, I would love to learn what you boys are doing. This would be great. <laughs> what do you think, Shayla? Sad. What was it, Ezra? Sad. Sad. Ezra's doing so stinking amazing with his reading. This lesson book has actually Mad. been super helpful. Good job. Good job. That's perfect. So I think like the one downside of it and for Ezra is that they, they are so repetitive in this book that he's like, I already know all of those letters and he doesn't want to review them and he doesn't want to do them over and over but that's the point of the book is to do it over and over so but he's doing super good he's like practically reading i'm so proud of him when the boys do their school on the floor like this which they usually don't where they usually sit at the table or something like that i just had them sitting here because i rarely record their school because it's just i don't know we're just it's like a time where we just focus so I don't usually record. We're literally standing here trying to make hoops with this little beanie ball <laughs> in Ezra's hoodie coat. Okay, let, let me try. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> one. This is definitely the one. So close though. Oh yeah! Woo! All right, guys. I am literally not even ready for the day today. So we've had this huge cold front going on, and with the wind chill, it's been between negative 20 and negative 30 outside. It's day too like even dangerous to go outside and like let your kids play. So we're not doing that. We've been stuck in the house the last three days, like legit not been able to go outside. So we're just hanging out. I am making coffee. I am going to fix this face up at some point because I know nobody needs to see this all day. <laughs> uh, the kids have been doing school work. They're almost done. I have been so obsessed with Fresh pre Fresh Prince. I guys, I call this Fresh Prince coffee because for some reason I cannot say French press without saying French Prince, which is why we have this little sign right here. Okay. <laughs> okay. So I was just about to go take a shower and then realize that I am completely out of diapers for Shepherd. This is why I'm so grateful that we use Shipped. I'm not even kidding. It is freezing outside, like I told you guys. Yeah, so I'm gonna order his diapers on the app. Honest wipes, yes please. And there it is, I'm gonna get his diapers. It is, I am so grateful that there's a company like Shipped that offers this service because otherwise I would have to get all my kids ready, go out into the freezing cold, drive there, which I'm just, I'm one of those people that don't feel super safe going out on the slippery road. And so it is really nice that they offer this. I just, I'm so glad I live in this day and age where this is a, this is a possibility. So usually I hang dry um, the kids' clothes, especially Cosette's clothes. I don't like clothes getting all faded and stuff. I know I'm super weird, but that's okay. I accept my weirdness. But it's so cold upstairs, I can't even hang dry these because they're not drying. They're not drying at all because it's so cold in the laundry room. So I put them by the fireplace. So basically my couch and by this fireplace has become my new little drying rack. Annie's doing this uh, dog vest, so I'm gonna help her sew it. Should I help you? I don't know if I should help you. I don't know well, if I want to. Well, I don't need help, but you said you <gasps> wanted to help me. You could do it, but I think because no, you sold it. I, the last few times, I had to redo it three times because oh, it was too hard. Okay. So I sold this really cute vest 
but last time mom was doing this, she forgot to do the chest, the, the, the neck one, and so she now has to do it. Let's see the food dance. Ready? The food dance. Oh yeah. Cosette, what are you doing, little lady? <laughs> she has been crawling. <laughs> She's been crawling all over the house. You cute girl, you. What? what? Should we get you dressed? You have no pants. Yeah. Yay, Shepard, let me see you. You look so handsome. You ready to go? Uh-huh. Now, if only getting your kids dressed was that easy every day, That'd be awesome. Who are you reading, Hanny? This one again. Again, Hanny's reading this for the second time. She's so tired, like so tired. And I kept her up about 30 minutes longer than I normally would, just because I'm, I'm trying to change her schedule slightly, but she's kind of mad about it. Kind of mad at me, actually. I have, I'm gonna go check the mail. So. Good luck, Hanny. It's like one degree outside. We are, like, just to check the mail, Hanny's like scared. I'm gonna go out. It's I know. I'm, I'm like cold just standing by the door. I hope it's worth it. Sometimes when you get mail, it's. Here she comes. <laughs> oh my gosh. I dropped the key. <laughs> It's so cold. Target, target.com. This is what came in the mail. Hanny, not worth the cold. Also, it came in a giant box. I don't get it. Look at the little tiny thing, giant box. Little giant. Cosette, hello. You're beautiful. She's obsessed with holding my phone. Like sh that, she wants to hold my phone all the time. It's pretty adorable, but look at her little finger. She's all, I know what I should do. Alrighty, it is time to take all these cute clothes upstairs and iron them. You're gonna iron them, I'm the watch TV. Yeah, I'm gonna iron them. <laughs> what are you doing, Ezra? I like playing this game, <laughs> It's like a hacking game. It's a hacking game? Yeah, like where you use this computer and then use this. Mm-hmm. And then this is our hacking phone. That's your hacking phone? Yeah. I can see you're hacking a lot of stuff. Wow. What kind of thing are you hacking right now? I don't know, I'm just finding something. Just finding something to hack? Yeah. Looks real good. So I am ironing these clothes right now. Look at how cute they are ironed. I don't like wrinkles in clothes. It is, I, I'm just, I'm very strange like that. Look at Cosette, Cozy. Hi baby. She's hanging out on my back thinking about taking a nap, I think. This outfit is super wrinkly. I just, I'm not a fan. I don't know why. I think I also really enjoy ironing. It's not a bummer to me. I really like doing clothes and folding laundry. So weird, I know. I'm challenging, challenging Kai to see who can stay outside the longest. Are you, are you sure? ready? Are you sure you want to do this? Yep, I'm ready. You sure? Sure? Okay. He, Ezra's been begging to do, handle it, handle it, <laughs> handle it. I'm not even going outside. Oh my gosh, I have to put this out there. I think you guys both win. <laughs> you both win. That was five minutes. Let me see. Come here, Kaya. I'm actually warm besides my hands. My hands are the only things that hurt. Your, look, your nose is bright red cold. So you guys lasted five minutes, and I, I didn't want you to stay out there any longer than that because that's just too cold. You did good. I can't believe you guys were out there. I'm fine. I'm not cold at all besides my hands. Okay, I only let them be out there for five minutes because it's minus one degree and even though they wanted to keep going, I was like, no, that is way too cold. But dude, 
You are so impressive. And Kaya, I can't even. Like, you're seven years old. Beast Wait, mode. Beast My nose is... Yeah, look at your nose. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this is Hanny with Coco next to the fireplace. This is where we've been all day, haven't we, Hanny? In this cold chill. Coco! Hi, Sissy! Well, Mom was. Hi! Well, we were upstairs while Mom was ironing, ironing but it's Chill, freezing. Let's go hacks. We were upstairs and I was ironing. We watched the first episode of. I want to call it like Marie Kondo or something. She. It's a Netflix series. And she helps people organize their houses, downsize, and become like more minimalism. And we're watching it to get ideas because probably the month of April or May, when it gets a little bit warmer, we're gonna be spending 30 days completely downsizing our house. And we're gonna vlog every day that month to sh just let you guys come along on that journey. So we're getting ideas right now and it's it's gonna be a crazy month when we start doing it. Um, I'm a little bit nervous, but I'm also just really excited. Cozy, who's home? Who's home? Oh, look how excited he is. Is it Daddy? Daddy home? Yeah. <laughs> look at how excited. You got daddy. Oh, that's so cute. Live the epic life and inspire someone with your story. Throw another log onto the fire. Because all. Oh.